guys, it's Vaughn, and this is a favorites video. It's so behind, I don't even know what month this is, so I'm just going to refer to this as end of summer phase. So I've been really busy, Michi and I, planning events and doing all this kind of stuff behind the scenes, so I have not had time to really film a video. Definitely not a tutorial. Those take way longer than these kind of favorites videos. So I will be getting back to the hair tutorials. It's just that right now I'm so busy, like, with these events and stuff, I just have no time to um, set those kind of videos up and film them and edit them. So I really apologize for you guys who are wanting that hair inspiration. It's coming soon. You guys know I'm the type of YouTuber um, who likes to get out in front of you guys and actually go to events and get from behind the camera a little bit and actually become active in the natural hair community. So I'm always going to go through these bouts of um, periods where I'm too busy to film. That's just going to happen. That's because I'm actually out and about being active in the community. I hope that's okay with you guys. So the first thing that I want to talk about before we go into the favorites is two events that are coming up. Of course you guys know about the industry standard fashion show that my sister and I do every year. This is actually the second year that we're doing it and that's coming up this month. It's actually on the 21st. I just want to give you guys a reminder and also let you know that if you guys were interested in coming to the event and you had not gotten your tickets yet, I am going to be offering a discount to my subscribers. I was thinking like, how could I have not offered a discount to my subscribers? What the hell? So I wanted to offer you guys a $5 discount off any single ticket purchase. And the discount code for that discount is going to be Miss Vaughn TV. So just enter that in right before you uh, check out with your tickets and you'll get the $5 discount. Cool? And right. also another event that I'm really excited about, Taryn Guy. She goes by Taryn916 on YouTube. Very popular uh, YouTuber. If you guys don't know about her, definitely check her out. She's going to be hosting a Love and Learn Your Hair. It's actually a tour, and they're stopping in Chicago. So this is really exciting for you guys who are fans of Taryn916. She's going to be in Chicago September 12th, 6 to 10 p.m. Uh, the venue is Castle. The Love and Learn Your Hair Tour sponsored by Motions. It's going to be myself and Michi on her panel along with Taryn. And then she has another couple special guests. She's got Nikisha Smith who is um, also known as High Maintenance. She's also a YouTuber. Very funny, very vibrant, awesome lady that's got some pretty cool and interesting insight on different topics. So that's what I love about panels because they get real interesting when you start getting to people's um, opinions and insights. It gets real interesting and it's just a fun time. I love panels. You can just really see people's personalities and stuff. It's really fun. Um, there's also going to be a hairstylist. Her name is Jennifer Rose. It's pretty cheap. Uh, it's like $15 a ticket or something like that. These girls have a lot of experience so I definitely wouldn't miss this event and I will put the event bright link below. I'll also add the event bright link to the Industry Standard Fashion Show. See all these events happening in Chicago. You guys asked for more events. You got them. So I'm going to put those links below if you guys are interested in those events and uh, if you have any questions let me know and we're going to move into these favorites. So the first thing that I'm going to talk about is my outfit and my entire look for the day pretty much. I'm very laid back. I have been so into tank tops this summer. It's been ridiculous. All I've been wearing is tank tops and cut off shorts. If I could wear that every single day with flip flops, I would be a happy girl. So I love wearing tank tops so, so much. This is just a regular um, like wife beater kind of tank top. I don't even know. I think I got this from like Charlotte Rue, so Forever 21, one of those kind of uh, stores. Really cheap. And I'm just wearing these Levi's jeans that I got from the thrift store. Actually, they were like $7. And I'm wearing these earrings that I got from um, also the thrift store. Uh, they're not real gold and they're not real metal, but they look it. Love these so much because they have that kind of woven look to it. And this ring I got as a gift from my little sis Alex. She got it from Aldo though. I actually got this for Christmas last year. I love it. It has that taupey color. Love that. My nails are a red cherry. It's actually called Ruby Ruby. And speaking of tank tops, since I've been wearing these a lot um, throughout the summer, I like to wear nice push-up bras underneath. I feel like I'm getting a lot of questions lately on Instagram and stuff from you guys about my undergarments, which I'm so happy to get those kind of questions because I want you guys to know that it is so important to have awesome undergarments. Your undergarments have to complement what you're seeing on the outside. You see all these awesome figures on these celebrities and stuff. Please believe they are wearing some of the most expensive undergarments and shapewear that money can buy. I get my bras from Victoria's Secret or Target, which are really good inexpensive push-up bras, but they're still probably around like the $20 range. So just know that if you want a good support bra that's going to give you that kind of like figure you're going to have to spend a little bit of money but the good thing about it is that the quality will last so speaking of bras under tank tops i want to show you guys um one of my secrets to actually being able to wear a bra under such a cut um tank top especially with a low uh, cut in the front or if the back has like that racer back i went to walgreens and i actually used these little babies i forgot what they're called 
but um, you can put your bra straps in here and it basically brings them together in the back and holds them very comfortably and discreetly. I have some that are in black like this, I have some that are clear, and then I have some that are like a nude kind of um, flesh tone color. And that's what I use for the back of my bra so that you can't see the straps when I wear my tanks. It also helps with the cleavage situation because it creates some tension that kind of pushes the sides up and gives you a little bit more cleavage. These are awesome. I got this from, it was like in a pack of like six or something from Walgreens. I can't remember what they're called, but just check around in the cosmetics section. You'll find them. Very cheap, probably like two or three dollars. These work wonders. I want to show you guys how I'm able to pull off such a matte finish um, in the summertime when everything's dewy and moist. And I tried a new product from Ulta uh, by NYX. This is the Matte Finish Finny Matte Long Lasting Setting Spray. It's all this French on here. I, I got kind of confused, but that's what the packaging looks like. I love that the packaging is actually matte. That's that's really really effective uh, marketing. So I got this from Ulta. It was probably like maybe five or six dollars. I can't even remember. But it's a finishing spray that you just go ahead and um, spray on your face when you're done applying your makeup. And I kind of spray from a nice distance because you don't want to wet the face up you just want to get like that light mist over it and it keeps my face matte all through the day now i'm not going to say this thing lasts all day like from 8 a.m to 8 p.m because i don't even wear makeup that long anyways but for like a regular i say like a six hour day this is going to keep your face nice and matte and for it to be cheap and easily accessible i mean there's an ulcer pretty much in every city uh, I would highly recommend this for you guys to give it a try, especially if you have like oily skin um, or if you have issues um, keeping your makeup fresh throughout the day. You might not want to continue to add powder and all that kind of stuff, even though there's, a, there's nothing wrong with doing that. But if you want a different option, something a little bit more practical, that way you can carry this around in your purse. You don't need like your powder plus a brush. A little bit more practical. I would say give it a try and um, tell me what you think. Moving on, I'll talk a little bit about my hair because I know you guys probably have some questions about it. This is just a basic flat twist out. I did this probably two days ago using uh, um, a medley or cocktail of products, which I'll explain to you guys in a moment. A lot of times we are looking for like this perfect product. We're looking for um, this magical product that does everything that we want it to do and it covers all of the bases, moisture, definition, uh, longevity. It's just this one product that does everything. Well, for most of us, that one product doesn't exist. And for different hair types, you, it requires um, a different layering of products to get the results that you want. So with this cocktail that I'm going to show you guys is four different products that I've been using together and they have given me amazing results and I just want to share the products with you guys. First one that I'm going to show you is probably a given. It is the Entwine uh, Cream Jelly Style. This is one of my favorite products ever since I've been natural. It just gives me the definition that I want. Whenever I'm doing my hair for a particular event or particular appearance or whatever, I always go for what I know and I don't take chances and I use the product that I know is going to give me the results that I want and that is the Cream Jelly Styler for definition. For the base to my hair and to help detangle, I did use the Moisturizing Shea Lo Leave-In Conditioner with Argan Oil by Coils by Nature. Now this is one of the newer products that I've tried. It's a leave-in conditioner that detangles and I absolutely love it. It gives me the best results. I fell in love with this conditioner. It was in my last favorites video. It's in this one as well. And I use this to moisturize and condition my hair and to detangle before I add any product. So this is actually layer one. And then the cream jelly styler is layer two. Now for the third or fourth layer, um, there are two options. And I'm sitting here looking at two of the most luxurious oils that I have ever used in my life. And I'm going to show them to you guys. The first one is this coconut oil from Trader Joe's. It's organic virgin coconut oil. This thing is about eight seven or eight dollars at Trader Joe's but you can get it at Whole Foods, you can get it at Treasure Island. I have to tell you guys it's the most luxurious oil ever. First of all, can I just say it detangles my hair. I know you guys are gonna be like yeah right but this detangles my wet hair. It makes my hair feel luxurious. I can take my hands through my hair like this as I apply the oil. This oil is amazing. I love the smell. It is nutty and coconutty. I love the consistency. You know, coconut oil is like, it reminds me of like Crisco or lard or something because it's it's solid when it's cooled down or room temperature. But then if any heat gets on it, it becomes uh, loose. This is what it looks like up close. Just luxurious. But also as another option for an oil is something brand new that I tried. Um, this oil is the Christian Fields Organic Nazarite Oil for Hair and Body. Looks like that. I love that it has like that kind of pointy little tip that makes it easy to apply. You can apply this directly to your scalp. I just love the bottle. It looks so cute. There's a eucalyptus plant um, just kind of floating around in there if you guys can see that. That is so awesome to me. This absolutely smells like eucalyptus. 
It smells exactly like eucalyptus and um, very earthy and herbal. I love it. In case you guys didn't know, the Christian Fields Salon is actually located in Chicago in Woodlawn uh, neighborhood. But these are um, salon quality products. So these are professional products that they carry in their salon. But if you're local um, in the Chicagoland area, you should definitely consider stopping by Christian Fields. If you do have locks or if you do have natural hair, looking for a hairstylist, you guys always ask me to recommend places. I would definitely recommend the Christian Fields Salon. Just a salon full of creative, talented individuals and half the stylists are natural so they get it. I love it. So I went in the other day because they actually are sponsoring our fashion show. They're doing the hair for the models. So I went in and I was having a meeting with the owner and I grabbed some of this oil and I'm so happy that I did. It is awesome. It smells amazing on the hair. It makes the hair so shiny and moisturized and just lovely. It's a lovely oil. I mean, again, it's, it's salon quality, so it's luxurious. So I would highly recommend this. So next I'm going to get into some fashion products here. Uh, just a couple things. First thing is a pair of shoes that I uh, picked up and wore a few weeks ago when my sister and I had our Style Q event here in Chicago. And that is the Steve Madden uh, platform sandals. You guys kept asking me about these shoes, asking me where I got them, how much did they cost, and how the heck did I find them. Well, for that event, Kira actually sponsored our outfits for that, which we were so grateful for. Oh my god, those outfits were so cute. But I bought these shoes because I'm like, there's no way I can wear the outfit that I wore. It was like a peplum uh, two-piece pantsuit. It was so cute. They had like this kind of shiny metallic finish, and these shoes just really set it off. So I love these. These are by Steve Madden. Of course, like I said, purchased from Akira. I love how they have this metallic kind of like wallpaper appeal, and it's kind of like that cracked look all around the shoe. And then on top, there's like these crystals, these beautiful, they look like Swarovski crystals, but of course they are not. If they were, I would not be able to afford this shoe. But it's kind of like that full Swarovski crystal look all over the shoe, just glistening, just glamorous. These are perfect for like a, a bride's wedding reception or something really glamorous like that, or a red carpet event, or even a nightlife look with some skinny jeans. You could dress it down, I feel. But you really need to know what you're doing as far as styling these shoes because they're so loud and you don't want to look overdone. But I love them because they're really comfortable. The platform makes them super duper comfortable. My feet did not hurt me at all the entire night. These shoes were $130 or something like that. So very, very pricey, but I mean, for the beauty that you get, I mean, Really. Next for fashion, I wanted to show you guys a couple of tops that I got from a couple of independent vendors. This first top that I'm going to show you guys is so freaking cute. It's by a company that is called Natural Hair Don't Care. I will put the links for these companies below. But I love this top. Wait till you guys see it. So it is that kind of pop art beautiful neon that was really hot um, over the summer uh, this season and it's probably going to be just as hot next summer too. I doubt that the neon trend is going to fade out uh, anytime soon but I love this top. It says natural. It's like that pow. It's got exclamation mark. I mean it, it just makes a statement. Now I've worn this shirt a couple times so I'm sorry you guys have to see it wrinkled. I just pulled it out of the laundry because I wore it twice already. It's like an off the shoulder kind of feel, kind of cropped, um, slouchy, has that baggy look. Um, very fun shirt. Absolutely love and last it. Last but not least, for tops, I want to show you guys this other super, super fun shirt. I wore this on Instagram and you guys went nuts wanting to know where I got it. So I'm going to give you guys the deets on it right now. This is the top. It's a Martin inspired tee and it says, you go girl. Uh, this is a regular t-shirt. This isn't a small. I went ahead and fringed it at the bottom and then I tied knots at the end of my fringe so that it could stay uh, looking nice. Love this. This is a shirt that is made by a company called Republican Company. They are based out of Chicago. The owner, Jason, actually gave me this top and I am so grateful. This shirt was so, so fun. I wore it to a barbecue. Everyone gave me compliments. I mean, everyone. And this is not the only slogan or, or quote that they have. I, I've seen you go boy I've seen uh, damn it Gina one of their newest ones actually says cuz I'm a lady which is like a shenanigans quote it's just so much fun if you're a Martin fan or even if you're not a Martin fan most people are and you are something that's fun you are gonna get so many stares this is actually one of the designers that are gonna be featured in our fashion show and the natural hair don't care tea is actually one of our vendors 
at the fashion show. So lots of fun stuff happening uh, right now in Chicago. I would just encourage all of my Chicagoans to come out and support this stuff. Um, Chicago is a city that doesn't get a whole lot of natural hair love, but lately we have been getting it. So take advantage of it, come out, support, that way the events can keep coming. And these major brands will want to support events that are in this area um, if we come out and, and show the numbers. So uh, I want to be able to provide events and, and fun things and education around natural hair for Chicago. So you guys got to come out and show your support so that we can do so. Once again, another long favorites video, uh, but I just had a lot of information to share with you guys and I wanted to be able to get it all into this video. If you guys have questions, let me know and I will see you guys soon in my next video. Bye.